Greetings everyone, the Good Sir Knight here with a quick little review I had on uh, two different tourniquet pouches I had that I found rather interesting and figured I might want to show you guys. So, on the plate carrier I have here, in general the place I like to keep my tourniquets is right in this area. So, I was looking at a good way to attach them and there are two interesting ones I found. First one I ordered, made in the USA, is the Blue Force Gear tourniquet. Now, now basically this will just sit over three bits of molly, so covering these areas here. And then the tourniquet will sit within these bands. So, if we take the tourniquet we have here, like so, it would pretty much slide down into these two when it was mounted. So, we're going to go ahead, we're going to do that real quick. Ugh. Mounting this one's actually not as, uh, not as bad as it seems. Actually, I'll give you guys a demonstration while we wait. So, while we're here, we'll pretty much take these. You're basically just going to force it through there. The, uh, the the bands will go through. They just might need a bit of uh, convincing, but it can be done. Ah. Yep, and just one more, and like so. So we've got the bands through like that, and then you just take the tourniquet, and you're gonna just want to force that through there. It does. Uh, they do get pretty wide, so you can fit it in there relatively well. Just a minimal amount of effort. And yeah, so there we go. And that would be the first way to mount the tourniquet with the blue gear. So nice, readily accessible. It's pretty nice. It's open, so there's nothing to move out of the way or anything. It's relatively inexpensive to get a hold of. And it gives you two little bands to connect your tourniquet. And when you need it, you go, oh no, my leg. And it's there. It's in your hand, ready to go. So it's a good option to have. Not bad. Very small, out of the way. Probably the most minimalistic I can think of. And then the second, which is actually the issued tourniquet holder, is the uh, cat tourniquet holder by uh, North American Rescue. So this is the actual issued one. I didn't know about until I saw my buddy with one, uh, Gojira. And so you can set up like a normal holder here, where it'll hold uh, go straight through, or you can actually set it sideways through a belt. And when you put it through the belt, you would pretty much. Uh, so get this. This will actually slide in through here. So once you uh, slide this through and clip it down, this will help hold everything in place. It'll slide through both of those. Those two will cover a single molly area and strap down. Then this goes, come on, all the way through. Much easier than you see now. Yeah, like so. And then you just clip it to the back end, and it'll hold sideways as well. So. Neat little feature. I liked it. Right now I'm keeping them clipped down. Now this one, as with most Molly things, you'll take, slide it through one, then the other. Actually, I had this a bit lower. Hold on. You actually have this thing closer to the magazines? Yeah. Did I? Yes, yeah, the thing closer to the mags too. So one, two, and I get three there. Come on. Yeah, I already have my MP5 mags hanging pretty low, so it works. Setting it down one lower. Clip it like so. Now this one, same concept, except now you have an open top case that will actually cover all of the tourniquet. So that if you're in a field environment and stealth is an issue, black does kind of stand out quite a bit. So, stuff that all in there. Well, especially if the, if the black doesn't stand out, the... Uh, the white most certainly will. I think this is easier to put in when you're actually wearing it. But yeah, so that all stuff's in there, and then this little top part will come up and over. And when it's better seated in, you can get to seat better, but for the purposes of the video, like so. And now it is tan and it'll blend in better with the environment. It will sit forward quite a bit, but when you need the tourniquet, simply pull up on this tab, expose the tourniquet, comes right out, so. Yeah, that's, um, that's all there is to that one, so two unique little tourniquet options. Always good to have a tourniquet on you. Mm, maybe less so for Airsoft, definitely more so IRL. So two little reviews, the uh, North American Rescue and the Blue Force. So those would be my recommendations, depending on what you're really looking for. So stay chill for us, everyone. Hope you enjoyed it.